Chess friends, whenever Alpha Zero and Stockfish match happen it becomes a completely different world like two supercomputers war against each other in chess, and chess friends, tell me in the comments whether you are a fan of Alpha Zero or Stockfish, before start the video, let me show your today's puzzle, it it 80 IQ puzzle, solve it and write answer in the comments, I will put puzzle answer in my video description, let's go, I started with knight f3, knight f6, c4 by me, we have e6, I played d4, b6 by alpha, g3, bishop fumetto system, alpha played c6 because it's pre-opening book move, he can play d5 on his next move, bishop e7 and bishop b7, castle, we have bishop g2, d5, I played castle, you might think, this is a free pawn, let me show it, if pawn takes happen, then knight e5, targeting this pawn with knight and bishop and also targeting on this one, so, in this position, alpha played bishop e7, knight comes to c3, we have castle, here I centralized my knight on e5, he targets it with bishop e6, I strikes the center with e4, you might think again, this is unguarded pawn, no it's not, knight takes, this targets this, queen takes happen then push your e pawn to forking on this and this, so, in this position, alpha takes the attacking pawn on e4, knight takes knight, pawn takes, I played bishop takes knight, bishop goes to b7, my light square bishop is targeting on kingside pawn, my queen is ready to go there, queen will very aggressive on there, re-rotate your knight to give some checks and create problems, so I bring my rook on e1, I want to use my rook like this to create problems after opening the king's structure, queen goes to c7, but I think it's a blunder move, I don't know why he played this move, I think he didn't watch my YouTube videos for few days, that's why he is making a wrong move, and chess friends, if you want to play like stockfish, then what are you doing? Subscribe to the stockfish channel to observe stockfish games and play like me, best move was to play bishop before, ok here I played brilliant move, bishop takes h7, sacrificing a bishop on h7 to expose the black king, and all the black pieces are in the queen side, so they can't help the king, so it's worthy to sacrifice a bishop, king takes bishop, we have queen h5 check, king back to g8, I re-rotates my knight to play knight check, try to folding the g-file to play rook e4, then checkmate. How the other pieces can protect the king when it will be a doubled pawn, and a very weak king, so we have knight to d7, try to protect this, I played knight h6 check, if you take it, let me show you, bishop takes, this and this checkmate is coming, so king h7 is the best move here, bishop back to give a discover check, king slides, queen check, king h7, rook up to e4, threatening to play rook h4 checkmate, how will you protect the checkmate, ha, huh. game will be over, so, back to the position, we have king up to h7, knight check, king to g8, knight check again, black can't play king h7, because the bishop and can enter the king's territory, queen will give a discover check and black's king will be destroyed, so alpha takes the knight, we have queen to g6 check, king goes to h8, queen takes check, king g8, queen check, king here, I could play rook takes pawn, let me show you, if rook takes e6 happen, then queen is threatening to give some checks, king here, check king to h7, rook checkmate, so, in this position, you have to play rook f6, try to block it, rook takes rook. Knight takes, queen takes f6 check, king h7, queen check, king here, king g8, the king can go here or there, if king f8 happen, then bishop h6 check, king here, rook e1 check, king slides, queen check, king backs, queen checkmate, the game is over, not actually yet, back to the position, I have to make time control, and I played some repetitive checks, queen check and king here, I finally played rook takes e6, knight blocks, rook takes, rook takes f6, queen takes, king h7, queen check, king back to g8, king to f8 isn't possible, I already told you why, in game, we have king to h8, in this position, I played bishop g5, threatening to play bishop checkmate, so, bishop back to f8, I played bishop check, here, rook goes to e1, I am threatening to play rook here and h5, checkmate, so, bishop takes, queen takes check, if king to g8 happen, then rook to e5 is coming, let me show you the variation, 
threatening to play rook g5 check, you have to block it with your queen first, then I will take your queen and checkmate you, so. Back to the position, we have queen to g7, takes, king takes, rook to e7 check, king here, rook takes bishop, Wish you all the best, thanks for watching, subscribe for more bye bye take care see you soon.